Hi there, this is Baron with a Let's Play of Ultima Underworld 2. We entered the large black, ro black rock jam at the bottom of Castle uh, British, and somehow I don't think we are in Kansas anymore. So what do we have here? Peaceful Goblin. He's just peaceful. All the other gods, uh, goblins are upset. And what would ye be wanting, human? I wish to go through these doors. Not without an order from the captain, Yumi. Till then, you are a prisoner. I will see that captain then. I bonds on the fifth floor. Okay, so the captain obviously is on the fifth floor, and these are some massive double doors, and they do not budge. Okay. If what floor am I on? I'm on the, on the second floor now. See, this is the first. No, this is the first floor where we entered. Here, there's the black rock. Okay. So I think that's where we came from, or not? No, that probably is where we came from. Yeah, okay. So we have to go through the portcullis here. Excuse me, move away. What does it say? Security courier, standard procedure. And there's another goblin guard. Why does the linger here be on their way? I cannot open the inner door. Where is the key? There is no special key. Just follow standard procedure. Uh, of course, if you've got the cash, I suppose I could update the on just what that procedure is. Uh, certainly not. Well, we can figure it out on our own, I think. So what do we have here? A bottle of water and a bottle of wine. We're going to take that. Maybe it will heal us. Yeah, we got two hit points out of it. Okay, open the massive door. Excuse me, open the massive door, I said. No, you can't open that massive door because it's locked, but standard procedure is close that massive door. Excuse me, close it, my friend. And drop the bottle. No, the bottle. Dropping the bottle, oh, is not standard procedure. Opening that door is standard procedure. You gotta close the door before you can open the other one. Great. Um, what do we have here? A lot of debris here. We don't need that. And enter. Next level. Let's shave. Save, just in case. And oh yeah, we had a we went up a level here, we're now level seven Shepard, we have two more skill points, that is nice. Now see we could already leave the level again here, but we will explore that level. So there's a goblin god. Hey Freemus, who let the ape in? Ha ha, how funny are you, man? So that obviously is some sort of joker here, a peaceful goblin god. Excuse me? Is that hair or grass that has taken root on thy head? Oh, they are so funny. Uh, we will show them what's what later, but not now. So what do we have here? Peaceful goblin god. The bottle of ale. 42, great. Oh no, I don't want to drop that, I want to drop that. Thank you. And there's uh, some, some, some water here. Uh, peaceful Goblin God, Peaceful Goblin God. Oh, there's a chest, a massive chest. This means you probably... Oops! And now they are upset. Yeah, but it didn't say it was like the, guard, the the chest of somebody, you know, it didn't say it was someone's chest. Okay. What, what's that with me, Yumi? That obviously is Freemus. Where are the prisoners kept? What prisoners? What that I say? Where do the servants live on their rooms? Oh, their rooms are on the next floor, Yumi. My regards to Felix. What else would he say? They are obviously slaves here. Okay. To speak to thee of the virtues of thy race. Huh? Is it not clear, Yumi, thy race was made to serve mine? <laughs> I think he has it backwards. This is the will of the guardian, else. Ah, the will of the guardian. Else, why would he send us plenty and blind their lames with plague and famine? All who deal with the guardians or his slave, like with 
than thou art the slave of a slave like with, and I suggest that what shall I lose time in the future? I shall then, okay. Let's not, you know, kill them now. So what did we get from... Oh, see, that, now see that uh, gauntlets belong to a goblin. If we would take that, we would annoy them. We won't do that now. We empty that barrel. Oh, it's just a junk in there. So what's behind that door? Oh, someone is taking a shower here. See, what's he saying? Hey, can't not take a guy take can't not a guy take a shower hereabouts? Uh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's get out of my face. That's pretty much all you can do here. So this is obviously the room of the guards or something. Yeah. The tower is just very small. It's not as big as Castle British. Most of the other worlds are not as big as Castle British. So it actually took us like 16 videos to get to the gem. Okay, Jenna. Oh, the holy oh, human. Are they hungry? Are in the right place? What place is that? We're in the kitchen, friend. My favorite place to be. You see, I'm a distant cousin of the regent, so I make sure the captain posts me here as often as possible. Who is the regent? Our king, of course. He's called the regent because technically, technically he rules in the guardian's name, but the titan has promised to allow us considerable autonomy. How pleasant of him. I see we understand each other. This is a pity so few humans are able to swallow their nationalistic pride and take part in the reshaping of our world. It is to be hoped that soon more of you will join us. Indeed, my countrymen are fools. So, let's not show your true colors here. This is true, this is true. This was a very sad thing. Jenna looks pensive for a moment. Well, enough sentimental talk. Will you have some food? Aye, and thank thee. Thou will find it in the kitchen to the east. I shall be seeing thee. So obviously the Guardian controls this world and there is a war going on between the gobs, the goblins and the humans and since the Guardian um, supports the gobs, they are obviously winning that war. And the humans are losing it. Okay, let's save again. Somebody use torch, okay. Oh yeah, you could you know create your own torch. See there's wood and we have a flask of oil and if you use the oil on the wood you make a torch. Okay. So what's in that barrel? Fish. But this belongs to a goblin. But there are no goblins here. Would they notice if I take it? Day old piece of meat. Take that. No, I think we do have enough food here. So, where's everybody? There's one. Marcus. He stares at you grimly, spreads his hands and opens his mouth. You see now that his tongue has been cut out. Uh, he obviously is not going to talk with us. There's another man. Felix. You see a man dressed in the terrors of what was once fine clothing. Who are thou and how comes another human here? Well, I've come to slay all the goblins I can find. So I have slain the goblins, then thou with the resistance. What is the resistance? In a sense, the guardian is my enemy. Thank the gods thou hast come. I had thought I would end my days cooking red meat for the gobs, but tell me, are, are Marks and I truly free to go? Nay, there are still a few goblins of food in this tower. It matters little now. My fawning arm was once feared among the goblin ranks. Oh, that probably wasn't good. There are too much goblins still around here. Let's restore. So let's not use that. So again, this is Marcus, he can't speak. Let's say something else. Shall we? Where's the other guy? Okay. Okay, let's try something else. 
I am the Avatar and I travel where Witcher guides me. I see, and what does Witcher guide thee to here? Well, I know, I know not until I understand the situation better. I see, then know this. And then do what you must. My name is Felix, and I was once Prince of Furnard in the north, and my men and I were among the first to fall, plague weak, starved to the goblin armies. It pleased them to make a slave of an aristocrat, but I know not how my men fared. Okay, we will continue this conversation in the next video, so thanks for watching, and see you soon. Bye.